by Jerome Russell and it's called Be Blonde. Now this one's got the blue, the blue strip is the, um, with the blue toner in. I'm not really, I don't know, I don't really like the blue toner so I think I'm going to go for violet colour next time. But what you're going to need to do is get your usual, uh, like, powdered, powdered bleach in the developer. Um, I'd say use 30 volume and uh, once you've made that mixture up of how much you think you'll need, use double the amount of shampoo and um, it can be any any white kind of coloured shampoo um, mix it up and just put it on your hair and like sort of rub it in as if you're shampooing your hair and it'll come out this kind of like foamy sort of dye and that will eventually strip off the colour in your hair like these kind of colours and it gets it's really good for even coverage and it's Bearing in mind it's still bleach so it's still kind of damaging. I'm going to start sectioning my hair. Now to section my hair I have uh, four, four hair bands and a... comb with them, um, whatever the hell that's called so that you can section it off easily and I've got some new new hair clips but there's only like there's only four of them but that shouldn't should be too bad um, so what we're going to do first is brush sorry my hair's been up in a ponytail on that so it's a bit messy brush through all your hair getting all the knots out so you can comb it through without having to cause too much damage. Um, now you need to, uh, even though I've got a shave side, what we all need to do is give myself a middle parting and always section your hair, like starting, starting from the front going up. It's just easier and you can see what you're doing. So we'll go up through here. All the way down, like so. And you want to do that all the way to the back of your head. Now I have no idea and I can't see what I'm doing, but this comb, because of the end, it really helps you sort of feel, feel your sectioning. There we go. Now, I know I look very strange at the moment. So now, what we need to do is section from the top, like the top of your ear here. So you go from the side of your head down to the top of your ear. Right, that's going to be your first section. Out the way. And then the second section is going to be, well, from my hair, um, my second section is going to be a lot bigger because of obviously I've got very, very thick fringe, choppy bangs, and that first one basically got rid of my, some of my choppy, choppy layers. So I'll grab this one. And then put it out the way. Okay. Now, uh, this is obviously going to be your third section, but because I have a shaved head, I'm still going to be dying over this, over this. All of this needs to be done over. So I don't really need to section it off. Just get the top bit. Still put it in the hair. Button. 
Mm, I'll put this down here. To get one more. Get the third section. And I'll make sure you get all the hair so there's no stragglers at the back. Just her section that way. Once you've done your sectioning, um, you need to section off those sections. So I don't need to do this bit because I've already, you know, I don't need to separate them. Right. But using um, some clips, any kind of clips, um, all you have to do is split them up, split your four sections into four sections of their own as you go through. So once I've done this bit, I'll undo this and section it into four layers and then, um, you know, put them all up, do the bottom layer first and move my way up. To dye my hair, I'm going to be using um, the Colour Live XXL, and it is absolute platinum. And the little code thing is like double O and then an A, so it's going to be like that curve. L'Oreal Alviv um, Full Restore Repair Mask, um, and this is just basically because I know people have had a lot of problems with the Colour Live XXL and saying how damaging it is and how uh, they really didn't like how the hair felt after and I do agree with you it is very damaging but I love love the results of it um, now this kind of the Colour Live XXL works with heat and it reacts better to heat so if you start obviously your scalp going to be quite warm so if you start from the bottom upwards um, it won't be so bad because the bottom will have had time to heat up to the same temperature as your scalp by the time you've reached the length of your hair. Um, also what you can do is if you can't be bothered to do that just blob it all on like in your sections for even coverage and um, plug in a bow blow dryer which is exactly what I'm going to be doing and just blow dry all over your hair so that it um, feels you know obviously you're going to be wearing gloves so you can touch your head um, see the warmth and feel that um, everything's so that your ends are the same heat as your roots basically so it all develops at the same rate. 